Hey guys, okay, so I just finished filming this book and it is a brown smoky eye because it was um, a video request from one of my subscribers. She requested this brown smoky look, so I did this for you and for those who wanted to see a brown smoky look with my version of a brown smoky eye. I really like this. I used to wear this all the time when I would go out to like dinner and stuff like that. And since I have a lot more variety of eyeshadows and stuff, I have been experimenting with a bunch of different colors. So I haven't gone back to just the black and brown smoky eyes. So that's why I really love this look. It is really wearable throughout the day and even transitions to night because it is dark enough to wear at night, but it is light enough to wear um, during the afternoon. So it's not as dramatic as, you know, just having pure black because it is a mix of brown, black, and a little bit of a green tint, so it is really pretty. I hope you guys like this look, and I'm really excited because today I checked my YouTube, and I'm almost at 200 subscribers. I'm at 199, so at 200 subscribers, I will be doing another giveaway for you guys because I have decided that I'm going to be doing a giveaway for every 100 subscribers that I do have. I don't know what I'm going to give away yet because I'm kind of... I'm kind of thinking about what I want to give away and what you guys would like, so if you guys have any suggestions of what you don't have what you would like, um, please leave it, leave a comment down below, just so I can get a better idea of what my viewers would like. I know my viewers would probably like makeup, like any kind of makeup would be good, because it's makeup and this is what my channel is all about. I hope you guys are having an amazing day, and if you haven't entered in the giveaway, I will link that down below. And I will see you in my next video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Comment and subscribe. And I will see you tomorrow right now. Bye. Oh, and please excuse my hair because I just I just woke up and I did my hair and makeup. And I'm not wearing, like, any clothes. I'm just wearing a big, flowy t-shirt. My hair is a big mess. So, yeah. I hope you guys have an amazing day. I will see you in my next one. Bye. Hey, guys. So I've already done this eye. So I will teach you how to get this look. So the first thing that you want to do is go ahead and prime your lid, and I'm just going to use the Smashbox Photo Finish Lid Primer. I don't know what this bump is from, so excuse me, and I just woke up. I washed my face and all that fun stuff. I moisturized, put my foundation on, I concealed. So if you're wondering, I did all that stuff already. Um, that's why my hair looks like crap, because I didn't do anything to this with my hair naturally looks like. Okay, so the first thing that you want to do is you want to go ahead and get a light brown, and I'm just going to use the L'Oreal Hip High Intensity um, Duo, and this is the last thing. So I'm just going to take that brown, and I cut my fingers, so I have a Spongebob thing right there. So I'm just going to use a regular um, eyeshadow brush, okay, so I'm just going to pack that on. You want to top off the axis because you don't want fallout on your face if you already put on your uh, foundation and all that fun stuff, so... So you're just going to want to put that on your all over your lid and slowly bringing that up just like that. The next thing that you want to do is you want to blend a lighter brown, so like this brown and then a kind of brown green. And I'm just using the e.l.f. Brighting Eye Color in Ivy. So these are a dollar, so you can find them at Target or eyeslipstakes.com. So I'm just going to mix those two together. And these two are just going to add a little bit more dimension to your eye. So you won't have just a brown, but you'd have a kind of gradient color. So after you're done with that, what you're going to do is you're going to take a dark black that you have. Um, I'm just going to use, it's a dark gray, so like a charcoal gray, and I'm just going to be using this one in the e.l.f. Duo in Black Licorice. So that's what it looks like. Then you're going to take a blendy brush, and of course I'm going to use my e.l.f. one. I'm just going to lightly tap that on because you don't need a lot, and tap, tap off the excess. And you're going to go with circular motions this. This is just going to build up the color, and then you're going to bring it up. And you want to bring that in a little bit more. 
Now you can choose on how dark you want it. Um, I usually don't do that dark if I'm wearing it like during the afternoon. If you want to wear it during the night, that's um, fine too. You could do it as dark as you want. The next thing that you want to do is you want to take a clean blendy brush. You just want to blend those two together. So it should come up to look something like that. The next thing that you want to do is, of course, highlight your eyes. So I'm just going to use the this highlighter that I love, and it's in the Wet n Wild um, Color Icon Single in Brulee. So I'm just going to take my Defy, Defining Eye Pencil Brush. Defining, defining Eye Brush. So I'm just going to put that in, tap off the axis, and put that right here, and then I'm just going to blend these two together. Okay, so the next thing that you want to do is you want to line your lid, and I'm just going to use the Maybelline Line Stiletto Liquid Eyeliner, and I love this because the brush is amazing. It's a sponge tip brush, just like that, and I just bought this, and I'm in love with it. I love it. So, I'm going to come up close, and I'm going to start from the middle, and then work my way down. And just look it up. So you can decide on how dark, um, how thick of a line that you want it. Um, to me, I kind of like a dark line. I'm just going to wait for that to dry. So after your um, liquid eyeliner is dry, what you want to do is you want to take a pencil liner, and I'm just going to use the Smashbox Limitless Eyeliner. So I'm just going to line my waterline. And then what you want to do is curl your lashes. And, of course, put on your mascara. You could also put on your fake lashes if you want. I'm not much of a fake lash person, so I don't really feel the need to do that. So, yeah, I'm just going to curl my lashes. And then the mascara that I'm trying out right now is the Perf the CoverGirl Professional Remarkable Mascara Hydro Foo, um Mascara. And this is the brush. But that is basically the look, and it's really fast, and it's really simple. I love this look when I'm going out. So that is the finished look. So I'm going to come up close, and this is what it looks like. So I hope you guys are having an amazing day. I will see you in my next video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Comment and subscribe. Bye!